the couple are expecting their first child in the spring, and during the tour of the country they will visit Casablanca, a snipe, and rabbit, on what is expected to be their final royal trip before they become parents. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex will arrive at Casablanca Airport on Saturday and they will be welcomed to the country by the British ambassador to the country, Thomas Riley and his wife. They will be greeted by a guard of honor. Then on Sunday they will head into the Atlas Mountains to visit Asnai and the education for all boarding houses there. Education for All is an organization which provides education for girls in rural areas of the country. It is run by a Morocco NGO and provides access to secondary school learning for girls between the ages of 12 and 18. The Duke and Duchess will meet some of those staying at the boarding houses as well as those teaching them, while Meghan will take part in a henna ceremony. Read more, Meghan Markle pregnant, how long will Meghan Markle be on maternity leave for, Kensington Palace confirmed the trip in a statement, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will visit Morocco from Saturday 23 February to Monday 25 February 2019. The Duke and Duchess's visit is at the request of Her Majesty's government. The couple will continue on to the Lyse Qualifiant Grand Atlas in Asnai and hear about education provision in the area. They will end their time in a snipe back at the original Education for All boarding house, where they will meet the organization's founder Michael McHugo who was awarded in the New Year's Honors list. Read more, Meghan Markle to have twins. Odds and frenzy for Meghan and Harry to welcome two babies the Duke of Sussex will present him with his honor in a short ceremony. In the evening, they will attend a reception at the official residence of the British ambassador in Rabat, where they will meet influential women, young entrepreneurs and disabled athletes. On the last day of their trip, Meghan and Harry will visit the Moroccan Royal Federation of Equestrian Sports to learn about the organization's new program which supports children with special needs through riding and caring for horses. They will see a riding demonstration and will hear from children and teachers about grooming and caring for horses. Next up is a cooking demonstration at Villa des Ambassadors, a pastime Megan is very familiar with having released a cookbook last year. The villa is where disadvantaged children learn to cook traditional recipes and meet disabled children in a specially designed restaurant. Concluding their pack tour in Rabat, the couple will visit the Andalusian Gardens, where they will hear about youth empowerment from social entrepreneurs. The couple will see traditional Moroccan arts and crafts on display in the walled public garden, and from there they will return to England. Meghan and Harry have been on separate trips ahead of their Morocco visit, as the Duchess traveled to New York for a secret baby shower hosted by her close friends. Meanwhile the Duke went on an official visit to Norway to visit Exercise Clockwork, a Royal Marines operation in Bargefa celebrating its 50th anniversary.